And about those freedom-loving Dems, Kamala Harris may have sent agents to raid a pro-life journalist home after she met with Planned Parenthood. So a report in the Daily Signal covers the raid on reporter David Daladine's house. He's the founder of the Center for Medical Progress. This is an anti-abortion operation. There's nothing illegal about that. Had he been on the other side of the issue, he'd probably been awarded a Pulitzer Prize. So he worked undercover to record what was going on. The allegations were that Planned Parenthood was selling the body parts of aborted fetuses. So in 2016, California, then Attorney General Kamala Harris meets with Planned Parenthood. Only two weeks later, Daladin's home was raided by the California Department of Justice, which under those circumstances may be a serious misnomer. This raid smacks of another coincidental raid, that of Matt Talibi by the IRS the same day he was to testify before Congress about government abuse. The Biden-Harris administration has weaponized the IRS, having them make unannounced visits to taxpayers' homes to harass and intimidate them. Supposedly, this practice has been stopped. However, if Harris Walls wins in November, look for that offensive to reawaken. <laughs>